Um, I think honestly, I think it's just kind of keeping a level head in the changing room. I think it's about it's still early doors. Obviously, right? we're only three games in. It's not the results we wanted. Do you know what I mean? But I felt like we were we were definitely um, in the games, if not probably the better team in, in most of the games and stuff. You know, we just kind of let ourselves down in certain situations, but. Um, but no, I think the most important is just kind of keeping a good spirit, um, having good training sessions, reflecting as well, obviously, which is important, um, having the video sessions with Tab and, and the coaching staff and kind of going over the mistakes that we made and, and making sure that we correct them and, and not do them again, do you know what I mean? It's it's all well said and done, kind of going on the video and, and watching things, but then having them reoccur, you know what I mean? So the main thing this week has obviously been focusing on certain areas, making sure we're, we're locked down in certain areas, and then obviously just, just training hard like we always do every day and just have a good good uh, spirit going on the weekend. The results, of course, haven't been what you've seen so far, but defensively there's been positives, you know, giving up two goals in the last two games. So what have you guys been doing right? I, I mean, I think I, it could be seen as a positive from the outside. Obviously, as a defender's point of view, it's – it's still a bit, of a, a bit of a negative, do you know what I mean? I like to keep clean sheets, that's what I'm brought here to do, do you know what I mean? Just as well as the goalkeepers and, and things like that. So for me personally, like I want to start start kind of racking up those clean sheets and, and I mean, if you don't you don't concede, you don't lose, do you know what I mean? So that's that's kind of our mentality and, and we need we need to get to that space. But but no, I mean, I feel like defensively everyone's working hard. Um, obviously the defenders are always working hard, but from the attacking players as well too, like they, they do a lot of running for us and make our life easy as well too in certain times of the game, you know? So. Um, it's definitely a team effort, but uh, no, definitely sure up some things, and hopefully, hopefully this weekend can be the first of the start of the clean sheets. Like, you've got Orange County coming up this Saturday, back at home, bounce back opportunity. Uh, interesting opponent, they have Milan Olowski, uh, Golden Boot winner last year. How do you contain him? How do you contain their offense this Saturday? I always say, I mean, everyone, if you're in the league, you kind of know about about Tom and stuff, and obviously being a Golden Boot winner, it's no it's no easy feat. Do you know what I mean? Especially. Especially after the season they had last year, obviously the year before they won it, and then they would obviously consider last year a disappointing season. And for him, they still be the golden boot winner with the season that they had is is really impressive. So we obviously know he's a he's a top player. He's a, he's a target of ours. He's highlighted that he's going to be a player that's going to create things. He's going to get in the end of things and stuff. So it's kind of it's kind of up to us as defenders. They they kind of close him down and, and um, they kind of keep him quiet for for most of the for most of the game. Do you know what I mean? But. It's just, it's just like every opponent we go on to, you know what I mean? You, you have those highlighted players and you have to be weary of them, but, I mean, we're always up for the challenge, you know what I mean? It's, as defenders, we love to defend, and, and you want to play against the best players. They challenge yourself every weekend, so, I mean, uh, we welcome it, honestly, and, and we're looking forward to, looking forward to a good matchup.